grand finalists. Welcome. On go. In five, four, three, two, one, go! Damn, I really think I woke up. All right. <laughs> here we go, man. Visibility is going to be a little bit tough, but here we go, man. We have to do it. They're going to have to count on that. Hey, they're going to have to count on the visibility, but hey, this could go anyway. I think still, I still think that Electric Blanket could do a great job at pulling this off and hopefully doing what they did before and going up 2 0 once again versus Shadow Moses. But will Shadow Moses strategize in the way they need to be able to bring this on? Let's see what happens right now, Kronzi. Yeah, um, hopefully we'll be listening on some comms from Electric Blanket. This is fantastic. Let's see what they have to say. And uh, the usual formation. Yeah. Might be a little tighter than usual, actually. Coming, yeah. coming in decently. Let's split to the left a little. Okay. I might have to uh, disengage on this opening yeah. if um, if Cobra goes on me. It looks like he's going he's really low all of a sudden. He might be going he for you. He likes to find that. I'm going to back a little bit here for Kama as he here. comes in. Him, yeah. My merge wasn't very good there. I might have to disengage yeah. very quick. Alright, I'm getting out. Yeah, I'm getting three shots on Kama. Get ready for the swap. Yep. Swapping right now. Yep. All right, here we go. We saw floor mat already taking damage, but moving away, being able to move out, and gimmick just doing some damage on his own. Be, I think they're right now, Crossy. They're trying to go after floor mat and hopefully take him out in the danger zone. But there we go, man. Floor mat doing some great damage against Comet Cobra on him. Shields are down for floor mat. Crossy, how are you feeling about this matchup so far? Yeah, lots of big damage exchanges in this first little section. We can see both Hornets suffering some nose damage. So there has been, you know, a little bit of a little bit of fight in here, but the arrows I would not expect to take really much of damage at all until the very uh, second half of the fight when, you know, those arrows become a little bit uh, a little bit easier to deal with. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, right here they don't want to get out of position because if at any moment, right, you can see these Hornets just turn and unload on the arrows right now, but it seems like they're right now concentrating on the arrows, and Comet is taking some heavy damage from both Format and Gimmick. Gimmick doing a great job maneuvering out of the way, and there he goes, Comet 15, moving away from danger. Right now, you see the tail and the nose of Format being red currently at this time. Can Electric Blanket hang tight in there and be able to take the first blood here in this matchup of the grand finals here he goes gimmick one more time i'm sorry this is uh this is cobra after gimmick and they're switching there goes cobra switching to floor mat right now being able to reposition himself properly and there goes floor mat taking off trying to get his shields back up doing a great job and shifting that power where it needs to go two thrusters the power going back to shields and then back to power giving that damage where it needs to go, Kronzi. Yeah, not only that, but disengaging not a moment too soon in every engagement we're seeing these arrows do because they can't really afford to stay in combat as we're all well aware of. Meanwhile, these Hornets are getting chipped down and down and down over and over and over again. And honestly, it looks like Comet 15's Hornet is a lot worse off. So it may not be long for this world. Once it does, we're probably gonna see that 2v1 coalesce. I mean, right now, Gimmick is very damaged right now as well. The hull, the hull for Gimmick is damaged. And then the Comet as well. Comet 15 with his thrusters up, trying to chase down Gimmick before his shields come back up. And are, I mean, this is going to be a tough one, man. This is going to come down to these last seconds. It might come down to a 1v1 Kronzi. But this is a dangerous position, not only for Comet 15, but also for Gimmick. They need to be careful. This is the longest I've ever seen a 2v2 go on today. And there he goes, unloading right now. Shields are down for format and boom! Goes. That's Comet. Comet is down. Comet. 
No. Comet is down. Electric Blanket doing a good job here. And Floor Matt, his shields are down. He's trying to maneuver away. As you can see, he had that power to thrust to get on out of there and hopefully stay alive. Here comes Gimmick taking advantage here against Cobra. This can be an easy 1v1. If Cobra can nail this, he can save his team and not go down 2-0 to Electric Blanket, Crouncy. Yeah, we just need to see Gimmick continue to apply pressure here just to make sure that the arrow cannot get any more damage on this Hornet. Look at that top left display. Not looking remotely healthy. Something that, you know, I probably wouldn't even take to the hospital if I'm being honest. <laughs> Man, this is a tough right now. It, look how tough it takes for Floormat to keep up with Cobra right now and be able to get the damage out. Wait, is Gimmick down? No, Gimmick is still alive. Doing no. a great job of staying away. Again, his... Power is up on those shields, and here they go right back to Cobra, giving it right back to him. Shields are down. They need to be able to output the damage and take him out of this fight right now, and there, there he goes. goes. Boom! Goes the Cobra, baby! Electric Blanket going up 2-0 in, in this Grand Finals, Grancy. That was an insane match. On go! In five, four, three... Two, one, go! All right, and they're off again here. Match point for Electric Blanket. Let's go! I think we're going to go ahead and patch into the so comms. Fast. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, I wasn't I'm, expecting I'm to get ready so fast, man. But, uh, yeah. yo, Kronzi, <laughs> let's go ahead and patch into Electric Blanket's comms real quick, and then... In a we'll uh, reconvene in a second. Yeah, good call. Oh, they're quite a bit higher than us. Comet's climbing pretty heavy there. Mm -hmm. They are going high, high, high. Do we want to play that? Uh, we'll, we'll meet them where we are now, probably. Okay. I do like to go high after all. Mm, they're just waiting. Now they're coming down. Remember Let's to not it, disengage. Oh. Here they come. I'm gonna go right on Cobra here. Cobra's on me. Okay, I'm gonna disengage. Alright, after a brief standoff, here we are, guys. Gimmick here is on Cobra right now. And on comment even on that Hornet F7C, trying to make sure that the uh, the biggest DPS output there is constantly harassed. Otherwise, they're going to be putting out all that damage right onto Floor Mat. It's a chase, a cat and mouse chase. Look at Floor Mat's aft there. They've taken quite a bit of damage there themselves. They're pulling in now. They're going to have to protect Gimmick. They have to make sure to keep putting that heat on. Kronzi, how's it going, man? Yeah, look. Barely an advantage with the amount of damage that was taken there, but we can see both these Hornets, their shields drop almost at the exact same time because of where these guys want to position. Everyone wants to be in the same spot and they sort of end up engaging and disengaging all at the same time, if that makes sense. This is crazy. That arrow is taking a ton of damage right now. Nothing sustainable yet, nothing meaningful yet. But if this continues, if these shields continue to stay down, if they continue to follow Gimmick, that'll be the end of the arrow. And if they can get the arrow out, that's right. that'll give them the game. They were being triangulated, but I think that they've managed to pull away. Their shields are now back up and running, and the fight continues. The fight wages on Floor Mat here is being focused. However, Cobra unloading everything they've got. Floor Mat has to pull away. Gimmick has to move in and peel off Cobra. Otherwise, it's going to be GG right here. Let's have a closer look at Cobra's camera. All right, here it is. Yo, so it looks like at the moment, uh, Cobra is, uh, well, 
the safest out of the lot, kind of picking his shots here. He has to put on, uh, push onto floor mat. Floor mat again uh, just lost their shields as they're uh, pursuing against uh, Comet here. Can we go and see uh, floor mat's point of view, please? Yeah, look at the damage on that horn uh, and still receiving more. Ah, oh, there it is. Go. Floor mat is done. Oh man, what an upset for Electric Blanket right here. But they still have one more teammate up. And ooh, who is Not that? So that was Gimmick. And just like that, ladies and gentlemen, Team Shadow Moses have now equalized. They are now two points apiece in this best of five. The winner of the next bout will be our Star Citizen Fight or Flight Grand Champions. On this road, what? The Citizen Con. Alrighty, competitors. On go. In five, four, three, two, one, go. There we go. I really, really put the chops in there for you with that Australian. That was beautiful. I couldn't have asked for more, Cronsy. I'm smiling from ear to ear. Here we go, guys. This is potentially the uh, the end, the, the, the last game here. This is a match point for Electric Blanket. They are uh, up uh, two games in this best of five. But before we uh, we do the commentary, let's go ahead and patch in the two Shadow Moses as they make their bid uh, for this first place. See floor map. Go up and down to 150. Place on gimmick. Floor map might be looking at me. Can't no. tell. But no. they have any? You have any radar locks? Yes. Okay. Be ready. Going on the gimmick. If uh, we're going for floor map, I thought. Yeah, yeah, yep. One match out. Yep. All right, what an amazing turn already. Shields are down on the floor mat. They focused all their fire onto them. Their after engine is deep in the red, but they haven't. Uh, they haven't done so without trading as well, Kronzi. How is it going, man? Yeah, good. Look, I'm very excited. This is very possibly the last match of the day. And if it's not, it could be the beginning of the comeback for Shadow Moses. So regardless, this is a very, very exciting match. And we've already had another situation like we did last match where it's going a little bit slower in this 2v2 because these players know when to get out. Whoa! Oh, a crash there! A collision. It looks like we lost gimmick, and uh, I think they crashed into a hornet. The hornet is still up and running. It's now the floor mat versus Cobra and Comet. This could be the upset we were looking for here. This could be Shadow Moses running it back and getting one point in here. Floor mat is still up and running here. Gimmick sadly is sailing down to the ground, and with that floor oh, mat no! is out. There were about two or three near misses. I was wondering, I was waiting to see, man, because it was close. Uh, but after a couple of near misses, one of them hit, they smacked right into that Hornet's wing. And uh, you know, like uh, it is how it goes, man. Now, however, Shadow Moses need two more wins to secure this. But with yep. this, I think they're gonna be a little bit more hopeful. Let's get it going for our last final battle of the night in five, four, Three, two, one, go! Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. On your left, you have Electric Blanket, the format, and the gimmick versus Shadow Moses, Cobra, and Comet 15. Meyer, it's all on you. All right, they're going in again. We'll see if we're going to have a repeat of before where we had um, the floor mat and uh, gimmick kind of being a bit slower there, kind of camping down towards the ground. Uh, or if we're going to have a straight up encounter. It looks like Cobra is kind of push, um, pitching up there, going up into the sky. We might have another uh, approach that we had before, but I think let's go ahead. Let's patch in to Shadow Moses and hear what they're saying and how they're going to be tackling this match point game. So 
spawn at? Yep. Gimmick. Just gimmick for a second. Gimmicks. Look at the distance difference. Gimmicks like yep. 300, 400 behind. Yep. I'm gonna slow down to about 150. Yep. Gimmick. I'm side streaking into them. Get ready. Yep. What's gimmick doing? Do you have him locked? He's just look. He's not looking at anybody right now. Well, Matt's looking at me. Going on to gimmick. Gimmick's on me. Yep. Gimmick's running. All right, here we go. Both teams doing a great job. Comet was trying to find gimmick on that higher ground. But here they go on floor mat and taking that damage. Floor mat needs to get away and be able to get his shields up here, Meyer. Floor mat has to run away, man. It was a good first pass there, but again, floor mat was uh, taking the brunt of that fight there. A uh, gimmick was able to just uh, pull away that damage, and that floor mat, as a result, has their shields back. Look at in relation here, Comet's uh, uh, Hornet. They have full HP, full shields. They're coming in again. They're pulling down and just converging right here onto floor mat. They lost the pip there for a second in the chaff. Chaff not as visible in the night when it happens. You don't have those visual cues, but there we go. Uh, floor mat still looking not good at the moment. They have to pull away. They have to just jet using the thruster of that Hornet. But now they, they'll, as a result, kind of split away from their team. Right now, it's looking good for Shadow Moses, but anything could happen at any time, man. And it looks like Kimmich here is pulling on to the arrow. And uh, But they must be being hit by the uh, the, the Hornet of floor mat, though, because uh, look at that. Look, They have no shields as well. But so far, yeah. man. Right Whoa, now, somebody one. big explosion. Who did we lose there? Is that floor the floor mat? The floor mat is down. And here we go. Shadow Moses going up. Two ships to what? one. Will Gimmick be able to bring this back? But as of right now, man, Shadow Moses looks like they're going to be able to come back to three games and possibly become our grand champions. Let's see what happens here, Meyer, in this final bout. Crucian, it's all down to this now. It's just two ships versus one. This is the underdog story, or it very much well could be. Right now, Shadow Moses is looking a very strong here. Comet just pulling after Gimmick. Gimmick trying to pull away, but there we go. Gimmick is destroyed there. And with that, Crucian, we have our Star Citizen Fight or Flight Champions. It's gonna be Shadow Moses coming around and taking it all. Man, wow, very much. Congratulations. It was a tough fight. It was that 1v1, but hey, it doesn't matter. Shadow Moses shows they're the best team in Star Citizen. Cobra and Comet, man.